three-year-old filly trotters. And they're off and trotting. On the far outside, it's Armbro Troika that's fastest of all in the early strides. Earl of My Dreams is going to assert herself. Impact along the inside. Are you talking to me is off stride. Moving through in the inside lane was Diamond Image just ahead of Back's Machine. And there's heavily post-time favorite Earl of My Dreams dropping in neatly into the four hole. Oh, blah, da. Took in from fifth, Armbro Troika wanting in from sixth. Seventh away was Casual Breeze ahead of Soulful Hanover Hornby Jean and are you talking to me is the distance off stride trailer. Impact pushed through to the front. Sylvain Filion on top by two on Diamond Image. The quarter was 28 and two. There goes Earl of My Dreams popping out from fourth. She's up on the move on the leader Impact on the way to the half. Diamond Image remaining in pocket position. Vax Machine on the inside from fourth. Obla da leading the back flow from fifth. Armbro Trika following her cover sixth at the outside. There's Casual Breeze back in seventh. Horn Beachine is eighth. Soulful Hanover ninth on the outside and the distance trailer after the early break are you talking to me it's Earl of my dreams up front 58 and 1 29 and 4 second quarter Earl of my dreams oh blah da stocks her into the final turn impact is back in the box and Armbro Trike is a second over fourth on the final turn diamond image is in from fifth casual breeze is moving up hasn't been asked yet and she's sixth only two lengths off on the outside gonna be a great finish soulful Hanover is seventh and it's backs machine Hornby Jean is ninth and out of contention. Are you talking to me? Earl of My Dreams brings him into the stretch. Oh, blah, da. Pesky first over. Armbro Troika in the center. Four wide comes Casual Breeze. Soulful Hanover is five wide. Three quarters, 28 and one. Earl of My Dreams. Here comes Casual Breeze and Tom Durand thundering down the center of the track and they will take home the Sire Stakes gold. Casual Breeze defeated Earl of My Dreams. Soulful Hanover and Impact Casual Breeze in 156 and 1. to run all the way into the paddock to track down uh, Tom Durand. He just uh, captured tonight's gold final with Casual Breeze and Tom, uh, this victory had to be pretty sweet for you. Uh, she's been facing some adversity lately, but she looked like her old self tonight. Yeah, and uh, what's really nice to uh, uh, consider here is that uh, she was undefeated in the OSS this year. That was uh, eight starts in the OSS and she uh, managed to win them all. Let's talk about race strategy tonight. You opted to uh, race from off the pace. I know you've said before you think she does prefer that racing style, but you had the gamble that you were letting Earl of My Dreams get away with some easy fractions up front. What were your thoughts uh, coming to head stretch? Um, coming to head stretch, I thought uh, I had lots of horse left. Um, I had gone back to her old racing strategy, how she had won a lot of her early races, and uh, she seems to like that come from behind. Um, She's very, very good when she's stalking other horses and she's got the field in her view. And uh, it worked tonight. She hadn't been quite herself her last few starts, but tonight it appeared she had that old late kick. Uh, she had a lot of pop in the stretch. Is that a fair assessment? Was she a little bit better than she had been? Uh, yeah, she was a lot better uh, tonight. Uh, I think uh, the season has shown a little wear and tear on her and we did a little extra um, um, work on her uh, in green wise this week and uh, I have to give credit to my wife for uh, taking such good care of her. All right, and uh, we've got the Breeders' Crown coming up. She isn't eligible. Any thoughts at all now after this of maybe supplementing? Well, there's always a thought there, but um, uh, we'll have to leave that up to the uh, owners and uh, a $70,000 Canadian supplemental to go on a horse race is a lot of money to think about. Okay, Tom, thanks for stopping by. Congratulations. Good luck in the, in the uh, Super Final. That's coming up November 4th. Great. Thanks, Greg. That's Tom Durand. Uh, he gets the job done tonight again, undefeated this year. Casual breeze in Gold Series action. Congratulations again to the Connections. Well, we've got race number... Tom Durand, and always a little bit frisky when it comes to her in the winner circle. And her winning owners also very happy there with the presentation, holding the blanket. And this is why, folks, she is just so bad when it comes to the winner circle appearance. But an outstanding three-year-old trotting filly taking the gold final.